Hello there, my favorite Resolume users. It's my favorite time again. It is update time. We got a feature-packed update for you, so without any further ado, let's get to it. We've got dummy slices. The slice input node now provides you with a couple of different preset dummies that you can use to test your patch. In this patch, I am using the stage droid preset to try out my slice chaser effect. Again, it is just a dummy. So when I use this patch in Arena, I can simply use the slices from my own advanced screen output. Let's have a look how that works. Here I am in Arena and I've got a simple advanced screen setup with just four slices. I'll apply the effect I've just made to my clip and drag the slices from the slices panel onto the slices parameter. Next, we have some updates for string functionality in Wire. You can now convert strings into floats and integers. Here I have made a string in node and renamed it to speed. This goes into a float node to convert the string into a float. Note that the float node outputs a boolean, true or false, whether the conversion succeeds or not. You also might have noticed that the float node has a default value. In case the conversion fails, the node will output its default value. Currently, the conversion is failing because there is nothing to convert. Let's change that by entering a value into the speed string. We can see that the conversion is successful by both our visual output and the succeed output. Note that I can write something silly like one horse. The conversion still succeeds as the first character in the string is a number. When I change the string to start with a letter or a symbol, the conversion will fail. You can now merge instance strings into a single channel. Here we have a sequence of integers that we convert to strings. Next, we use the merge node to merge them into a single string before rendering it out. Notice how we go from instance integers to instance strings into a single string. The separator inlet can be used to add characters in between the merged channels. The substring node now has the option to wrap its contents. Here we have a string that we send into the substring node. Next, we enable the wrapping mode in the node panel. As I move the start position above the length of the string, the substring node wraps its contents. We've updated the choice in node. Previously, the choice in node would use buttons in the arena and avenue interface until a certain threshold was reached before switching down to a drop down menu. But we say power to the people and have given you the option to pick between buttons or drop down menus in the node panel whenever you want. And lastly, we are taking a look at a nice new arena and avenue feature. We have overhauled the blend mode menu from an insanely long list to a more compact menu. You can favorite the blend modes you like the most and create new blend modes in wire directly from the menu. And that was it for Resolume 7.10. We hope you have fun with this update and that we might see you again in the near future for more updates. Stay tuned.